Hello everyone, and welcome back to Avengers. This is part 14 here. Uh, we just got back from the mission Agony and the Ant Hill, and we we're just going to continue the campaign here. Let's see where we go. I guess we're traveling to a destination. Hmm. Alright, and it looks like we got some new uh, fabrication stuff, so. Um, I guess we'll have to take a look at that. Or I guess a new pattern. So I'm really curious to see what that is. here. What's this? Oh, never mind. The particles Dr. Pym promised. Good luck, Iron Man. Thanks. I'm, uh, gonna need it. What exactly is this Starboost thing? Meet me in the tech lab, kid, and see for yourself. That was a little, kind of a janky cutscene there. Every test I did before ended badly. But with this new miniaturized accelerator, I have a shot. Sorry, I just wanted to check this out real quick. Um, increases the impact st st stun damage in reaction severity of power drive. Oh, okay. And then, sure, we'll do that one. So we got all the repulsory and melee stuff. So can, after that we can just move on to some lasers. Really cool. Oh, do we need to go up here? Oh, that's the thing that was cut off. Oh, 
Oh boy. Looks like some space armor. One point four billion dollar vanity project. I may incinerate on takeoff, but I'll look damn good doing it. are in the green, sir. But I must warn you, a large storm system has moved into your direct flight path. Never rains, but it pours. Well, we can't wait any longer. Tony, I loaded up some music to give you a little boost. Oh, no. Don't worry, it's not mine. You can do this. Thanks, kid. Okay. Three, two, one. This is tough. Hopefully Thor can help out a little bit. Or Thor gives him a boost. than in human. No more regen formula, no more adaptoids. High fives all around. Uh, there we go. I don't know why it was not allowing me to go down at all. I think I had the first appearance of uh, Iron Man's like space armor. I'll have to look that up after 
uh, recording this. Covered in space dust, this place does not get a lot of foot traffic. Just a little hack through this next door without waking anybody up. This looks like a boss room if I ever saw one. I bet there's something in general is bound to happen. I mean, there's... It, I don't know. I feel like we just can't go through this whole area without meeting some kind of danger. Can't go back down. Where else, where else is there to go? They're trying to keep something in. Not quite sure what that is. Don't trust it, but I don't know what that is. So happy right now. Wait, what is all this stuff? Where am I? Tony? Are you hugging me? What? No, I just did what 
watch it fall. Then why aren't you letting go? I just... We thought... I mean, I thought that... It's good to have you back, Captain. I'm so confused. Yeah, come on. Gotta get you out of here. Come on. Wait, 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 wait. Tarleton. Did he survive? Tarleton? Who cares, what? The explosion, he was too close. He survived. Thanks to you, apparently. And Monica, if you believe the news stories. That doesn't make sense. <clears throat> okay, I got you. The evacuation. All those people. Yeah, we'll get to that. You think you can walk? Yeah, it's okay. I'm good. Let's do this. There's the cap I remember. Come on. Okay. What's the plan? Uh, well, we find an escape pod and, uh, escape. You're winging this, aren't you? Yes. Yes, I am. Actually, didn't think I'd make it this far. Tony, where is it? Where's here? Oh, well, we're in Spain. Okay. My God. You weren't kidding. Nope. Honestly, really happy because Cap is like my favorite Tony. Avenger. What? What's happening? Well, it's a long story. <laughs> How long? Was I? Yeah, well, five years, which, by your standards, is just a power nap. I'm starting to think people just prefer me on ice. See, you're already making jokes. Corny. But that's normal for you. There we go. We tell him. Tony, I'm working on it. All right, got it. Let's go. What the hell? Oh, don't mind the killer robots. <laughs> Hurry, get it over. I'm trying. For a dead guy, you're really pushing. to brute force this thing. Why didn't you start with that? I get that he's a super soldier, but I feel like it would hurt your bare hands to just punch or metal like that. Oh, jeez. Oh. 
That's horrifying. That was absolutely awful. Nice. Since we're gonna die anyway, you have any, I don't know, last confessions? Your jokes. I just don't get them. I know, I've read your diary. <laughs> <laughs> Why'd you smash the reactor cap? A lot of people died. Tony, there was something buried deep beneath the bay. Somehow linked to the reactor, working its way to the surface every minute. It's the earthquake. I had to do something. The entire San Andreas fault was about to blow. The ocean would have consumed the city. Millions would have died. Never doubted you for a second. Just had to hear it, you know. Hello. Hey. Am I always going to save the day? I expect nothing less from the God of Thunder. Hi, Thor. Welcome back, Captain. <laughs> That's awesome. with your mind just think of you all infected me with his blood it could have killed me but it didn't remember the dream George how could you make me one of them I made you strong you stole my hope and now Give you the same odds that I had. <laughs> I will rip the earth of superpowers. Even if it has to end with me. Yeah. Cool. He's got that costume on. Steve. Nah. God, his 
good to see you. Listen, if I had known you were alive, that they had you. This isn't on you. Tarleton didn't even know Monica had me. What? Ada, the heist. Monica hired Taskmaster to steal a Terrigen crystal. His men triggered the security protocols, initiating the Chimera's autopilot. But that thing in the bay, that was unexpected. The heat signal. It must have been what caused the earthquake that took down the city. What was that? I don't know. Nat, I'd, I just keep thinking. If I hadn't. All those people. No. This is not your fault. That ship was never supposed to be in the air. I would have done the same thing. You're alive. I knew it. Um, come on. You should really see this. Welcome back, Captain Rogers. I know I speak for everyone when I say that you are a sight for sore eyes. Thanks, Jarvis. It's good to be back. Since the Chimera's near crash into Manhattan, the situation has become dire. I fear that AIM will use this as an opportunity to ramp up their persecution of all the Inhumans. We can't let that happen. The world needs the Avengers now more than ever. We are preparing for our final confrontation with AIM. I have completed my analysis of Mr. Stark's plans to equip the Avengers for this anticipated confrontation, and will need some special materials to complete them. Thanks, Jarvis. Time for us to get back in fighting form. Let's see what we need. Excellent, sir. As part of the effort, we might want to help our allies. Commander Hill and Dr. Pym are both reporting serious difficulty in coordinating our efforts due to AIM's draconian control over world communication networks. How can we help? They have requested we destroy AIM's main communication hub to help unite the Resistance efforts. Let's oblige them, old friend. Speaking of the media, reports of our own Thor Odinson working with ex-AIM scientists in a remote part of Scandinavia have started cropping up on the news. This may be part of AIM's propaganda campaign against the Avengers, but it bears investigation. Agreed. Let's get Thor on this ASAP. Awesome. Or you have new gear and the new gear is like not that great. Kinda of curious about the cosmetics. Okay, so we got that's a cool outfit to have. Um call it here and so when we come back uh, we're gonna go make these uh, Stark Tech outfits here uh, thank you everyone for watching I'll see you guys in the next